In this tutorial, we will be looking at how to solve more complicated rational expressions, like this one. We will be following the same steps you learned in the previous video. Let's get started. Solve the following equation and state any restrictions. Step 1. Factor the denominator. In our second term, we can factor the denominator to get x minus 3 multiplying x plus 2. From the third term, a 5 can be factored out in the denominator to get 5 multiplying x minus 3. Step 2. Find the lowest common denominator. Take the x minus 3 from the first term. Now, from the second term, because we already have x minus 3, we only need to add the x plus 2. Finally, from the last term, we add a 5 to our lowest common multiple. An x minus 3 has already been added. Step 3. Multiply both sides by the lowest common denominator. As we multiply each side by the lowest common multiple, it is then multiplied to every term. Go through and cancel where possible, which leaves us with an equation with no denominator. Step 4. Solve for the variable. First, expand where possible. Combine like terms. Now solve for x. Add 50 to both sides and subtract 4x from both sides. Finally, divide both sides by 16. We can reduce negative 42 over 16 to negative 21 over 8. Step 5. State any restrictions. We have x minus 3 and x plus 2 as factors in the denominator. Solve each for x to get x cannot equal 3 or negative 2. The final answer is x equals negative 21 over 8 where x cannot equal 3 or negative 2. In this lesson, you solved a rational equation. It is important that when solving more involved equations that every step is completed fully before moving on to keep the problem manageable and solvable.